Hello, Sagittarius. Welcome back, everyone. This is going to be a reading for our all Sagittarius placements, okay? So let's get right into your message. All right, so we have time. All right, delay, procrastination, too busy. All right. So something about a delay is specific, significant. Maybe somebody is saying they're too busy. They don't have time. So we have mask. Okay, and we have blocks. Okay, so somebody... I feel like somebody is procrastinating as far as revealing something that you need to know about them. We have toxic, drama, arguments. Alright, so somebody is like blocking the fact, blocking off that they need to reveal something to you and they need to say something, they're delaying it, or somebody is just refusing to show themselves, show how they really feel, or something of that nature. What is this message here? Alright, so we have envy. Wow. Okay. Hmm. So somebody is refusing to speak up about their toxic envy. It's Wow, let's just see. I'm, I'm curious to see what the hell. Now give me one more. Okay. Give me one more here, please, for my Sagittarius. Okay, so we have tension. Okay, stressed out. Yeah, somebody, okay, wow. It's almost like somebody is supposed to be an enemy and they are kind of like worried that they might be falling for this their person who they supposed to go against yeah we have love somebody is lusting out out the somebody who they supposed to be envy or or competition with or somebody who they supposed to be like beefing with somebody is falling for this energy all right so therefore something is delayed the job cannot get done with this time energy because some, somebody actually likes somebody. That's what I'm getting here. We can see because it could be something totally different, but that's what I'm getting. So we have time to a cups. Yeah, I'm definitely getting something is delayed due to somebody liking someone. Just period. Someone actually is building a connection with somebody, but they're supposed to be here to be the page of source, to get some sort of information, to be fake or... They're supposed to be here to gossip, but really they like you. They fuck with you, Sagittarius. Okay, so we have the High Priest. No, I'm not taking all those. But the High Priest is trying to come out with 10 cups of tower, 6 cups of 8 cups of 2 of them. I'm not taking all. Okay, that's too much. What's this kind of energy? Okay, so we have the Hermits. Okay, so this could be a Virgo. Somebody is hiding here. Something here to start. And then we have, give me one more for this time. The tower. It's almost like somebody is delaying the tower. The nine of ones, they are nervous to bring the tower to someone. They don't want to do it. Okay? Someone is like, I really don't want to have to do this. Very interesting. Yeah, the seven of ones. Somebody is trying to stop themselves from doing something. They are delaying something. This could be a movie you're watching. This could be have something to do with a Virgo or Aquarius. Okay, what's the mask energy? Let's see. This is a very interesting reading, y'all. What's the mask? I'm getting to you. Um, you this Virgo is trying to heal something with you, or this Aquarius. Somebody might just shock you and surprise you with something too. I'm getting to somebody is pregnant. Congratulations. This is you, Sagittarius. This could be your child. All right, what is the mask energy, y'all? Let's see. All right, so yeah, the seven of swords here. Somebody is definitely lying, cheating, sneaky. Somebody has a plan, a plot, or somebody is lying about who they truly are. What's the seven of swords in this mask energy? Okay, so the ace of wands, yeah. Somebody, this is someone who's coming towards you or who is, like, you kicking it with them. Y'all done spark something off new. Okay, so we have the six of pentacles and the lovers. Yeah, this is this could be a Gemini or somebody is doing something for a Gemini. But I feel like somebody is giving you something or they're supposed to be there to sneak with the seven of swords. But instead, they are giving you love, affection, niceness. Very interesting. With this block energy, I feel like you don't really say much to this person for some of you. Or somebody is trying to talk to you, but they're doing this for somebody else. Or 
This is the blog energy. This is very... <laughs> so somebody's done fucked around and fell in love with the fucking Target. What? That's kind of what I'm getting here. Talk shit. What's the blog? Okay, so the sun card. So I feel like you blocked the Leo or this has something to do with you because you blocked this Leo. Okay, so somebody could be being sent from a Leo by a Leo to get some sort of information and said this person fought in love with you or some shit like that. Okay, so yeah, we have the seven of cups. Or you you you're confusing somebody because you are not fully opening up, maybe, or somebody let's see, what's the sun card in the seven of cups? Okay, so yeah, you the high priestess. Yeah, I feel like you're not fully opening up. And this is why somebody like you, the five of wands. Yeah, somebody is fighting to get you to tell your secrets, but you're not doing that. The seven of wands. This is making somebody like you even more. Because you're like standish off because you're not saying nothing. But really, you're the devil card. This is like, this is making somebody like you more with this toxic energy. This is beginning to be very toxic for someone. Okay, because somebody now looking at this as a gang, like now they want to win you. This is really strange. Okay, very strange. What is this toxic? No, what's the high priestess? This is a strange reading. The king of swords. Oh, yes, you, you just, you're just cold. You're not really saying nothing. You say little words. To somebody who is supposed to come, you, so this is, so I feel like someone is trying to get in your energy field, talk to you, get close to you, be your friend, maybe somebody is sending you DMs, trying to be cool, but really it's for, you know, it's just for you to open up, but you're not, but this is, this is, let's just see, because I got to pull this shit together, what the hell, what's the toxic energy, so there's a lot of drama here with the drama, what's toxic? okay, so the world, oh yeah, this is the situation, y'all, This is a situation where I feel like somebody just want to wrap this whole thing up. They like, man, fuck it. I don't even want to do it. Somebody don't even want to be a part of this little game, this little plot, this little scheme. What's the seven of swords? What is the plan? The plot, the scheme. Like, what is what was the, what was this seven of swords trying to do from the beginning? Okay, so the three of pentacles, the ace of pentacles, so they're here to get something from for this group. Okay, somebody was meant to bring some sort of news back or they're meant to, for you to, they, they trying to, you're meant to give this person something so they can take it back to this group or they were trying to teamwork, the plot was to, yeah, this is for like a plan, like for some people, a group, the plan was to be your friend so that you can say something, page of wands, and it was going to fuck you up in the end, ten of swords. I don't know why we always get, in, um... We always get messages like this for you, Sagittarius, for some odd reason. Okay? Like people trying to come and talk to you just to get info from you so they can take it to somebody else type shit. Alright, what is this envy energy here? Why is this envy here? Because, so yeah, I'm getting somebody is controlling. Like somebody literally supposed to be here to be a... Uh, enemy towards you but now they are like it's not like that anymore they are resisting this in, in, in um yeah the judgment they are releasing this energy the full card because they like you like somebody like you this much the nine of cups somebody rather just like somebody fell in love with you in the process of trying to investigate you with some shit so they rather just leave you alone Okay, because there's too much tension or worry that we're really stressed out. What's the tension energy? What is this person stressed out about? This is a very interesting reading. Okay, so yeah, the Queen of Wands about you, the Ace of Swords. They like, man, this person is the truth. They real as hell. Like, every time this person you talk, every time they come around you, you just give them, you just show them real ass vibes. Just period. So, therefore, every, everything that they was meant to do or everything that they were meant to come and say, do to you or whatever get information from you is it it's just it's nothing king of wands like you this is masculine female whoever it just you don't give them what they expect like you really give them niceness pureness love or you give them like sexy type energy or some shit the fact that they that and now they like you now this could just be like 
Maybe you just give somebody respect. Like, maybe this has nothing to do with your looks, your sexiness, your beauty, anything like that. It's just like, man, I respect that Sagittarius. Bro, I don't even want to do that to that Sagittarius. Like, they too real or that's how somebody feels. Somebody feel like you real, you 100. Okay, yeah, the page of ones, the things you say real as fuck. Yeah, that's what somebody feel like. So, therefore, somebody just like, man, fuck this shit. I don't even want to get the death card. Like, the death of five of ones. I don't even want to fight. Somebody's like, I don't want to fight. I don't want to help nobody fight this Sagittarius. I don't want to help nobody argue with this Sagittarius. Because at the end of the day, I feel guilty for being spiteful. Five of swords. That shit actually break my heart for real. Because this motherfucker Sagittarius is so real. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hold back and move on. Because at the end of the day, that motherfucker Sagittarius is the truth. That's how somebody feels. What's the advice? So the advice, keep doing you, the empress, continue to be in this empress energy, continue to grow, be nurturing, be who you are, Sagittarius, be a good mother, be a good person, don't be spiteful, let the universe handle this, its karma, okay, I mean, let the universe handle motherfuckers' karma, don't try to take it into your own hands, the empress know that she is fully taken care of, no matter what, good or bad, she just do her, she live fearlessly, Okay, don't, there's no reason to be in a fear with this empress, in, uh, empress, empress energy. Don't live in fear. Don't be paranoid. Another day, you're 100% straight, good. Do your part as far as just praying and keeping yourself close to God. That's all you got to do. The two of wands. Yeah, make, just continue to make good decisions, right decisions. Okay? So, let's see. Give me some messages here. Okay, so, yeah, the positive outcome core. Yeah. All this very, uh, at this very moment, you are sowing the seeds of your future through your thoughts, feelings, beliefs, and attitudes, whether through love, fear, or indifference. You are always creating something, so remember to keep your thoughts, beliefs, and attitude positive, and you will create a positive outcome. This is what I feel like so many people need to hear right now, just off the personal readings that I've been getting here. Okay, everybody needs to think positive. Know that the positive, you got to think you are sowing seeds as you think. So if you are constantly thinking negative about a home, house, car, job, future, this is that's going to be your outcome. Okay, if you're thinking positive, that's going to be your outcome. You're constantly sowing seeds. What you just need to do is trust and believe that God got you. Okay, baby, that's what I have for you. I will see you on your next video. Bye.